a little bit later in my mission, we kind of set the same thing. We wanted to go to an area and, and knock doors and just look for an opportunity. And so the houses back east are a little bit different. They're all stacked right next to each other. A lot of times you can walk down one porch and then walk right up to the next door. And so we were knocking on one side of the street and we weren't having much luck. No one was home. It was kind of in the middle of the day and a door was open on the other side of the street. And so I suggested to my companion, why don't we go knock that door that's open so someone's probably home. So we went over and we knocked on the door and we, we met a, a lady named Maria and it turned out that she wasn't supposed to be home that day. She wasn't supposed to be home at that time of the day either. She had had to take a day off for, a, I believe it was an appointment, a doctor's appointment for one of her sons. And so as we taught her that day, we, we knew that it was meant to be and that she was ready to accept the gospel. She accepted the invitation to be baptized the very first day meeting with us. And we thought it was great. We, we could tell that she was prepared to receive the gospel. And it wasn't until later that we had seen how much of a miracle that it, that it was that we had found her and, and were able to teach her because she told us of an experience that she had when just a couple days prior to us coming and knocking on her door, she was praying one night and she said, God, tell me what to do. You know, I'm kind of lost. I, I don't know what to do. I have these two sons and my husband's gone and I, I just need guidance. I need to know what to do. And so just please show me the way. And she said that as she prayed, she had the feeling that just said to her, don't worry. I'll take care of it. I'll send you help and, and I'll prepare a way for you. And so when she told us that experience, she had realized that we were sent by God that in a direct answer to her prayer, the way everything lined up that we happened to be in that area and knocking doors when she wasn't supposed to be home and that she had had that experience and she realized that, that God was talking about us and, and not specifically us, but the gospel that the gospel was meant to come to her and into her life. And it was just such a sweet experience to be a part of that. And to just to see that miracle, to see God's hand in someone's life who, who didn't have the gospel, that was praying, that was seeking God, and that received an answer to their prayer.